John, how many of these are we going to try to take out? Right now, I think we're ready for the ground to come out and we'll stack so that the construction company that's coming in on Monday to take the windows down will have room okay. to kind of move. Let's just set them here and keep moving them over. And so basically, we're going to stage what we're going to get later. Are we taking all these? Yeah. And what is the game plan? Uh, I think these are going to go to New York City. Chuck from Old Good Things showed interest. Okay. But we have to have a place to store them in the interim before they can come and get them. Do we have anybody locally that's going to be using any of these? A few of these are going to be cut down to eight footers for the congregation or six footers, and we'll cut those down. So some of these are going to be coming back? Some of these will stay for the people that are in the congregation here in the community. All right. But none of them are coming back. This building will be gone in two weeks. Have Have anybody expressed interest in keeping these for their own individual homes or anything like that? That's the congregation will use them in their homes, okay. not for the church. All right, gotcha. The okay. new sanctuary is already built. So this is what we do every day. We just run around and do nothing. Mm -hmm. We'd like to get the chandelier. I don't know how we're going to do it. <clears throat> the chandelier is about a 10 foot. Yeah, it's amazing. It's very, very cool. So we'll have several trips um, back and forth here this week to empty all this out. Um, we'll probably be spending a majority of our time hanging out here, salvaging what we can. Um, you know, it's just a shame that a lot of this we're not going to be able to get our hands on just because the fact that, you know, a lot of it is decorative plaster work like the, the stars and things like that. So unfortunately, a lot of that stuff is going to have to go down with the dozer. But um, it's sad, you know, but you know, you got to weigh everything in this, you know, and they've really put a lot of numbers to this, a lot of thought, and it just is not feasible. And so they're building a brand oh, new nice. piece. Brian, how are you doing? Fantastic. You good. Joe showing butt crack. We don't want that on camera. He made for me five dollars. He's a plum he's a plumber on part time. Alright, Brian.